It's time to open up the January edition of the Keto Box. Let's unbox these treats right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, crazy Ketos. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like product reviews, we do recipe videos, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com, and that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah. So it's time to open up the January edition of the Keto Box. I love surprises and there's always surprises inside. Yeah. Now, if you don't know what the Keto Box is, it is a monthly subscription box. It comes with all different types of keto treats, things like that. Very similar to Keto Crate. Mm -hmm. People ask us all the time, like, which one is better, the Keto Box or the Keto Crate? Honestly, they're both about the same. Generally, what's in one shows up in the other one, either the same month or the next month. A uh, couple things that I like about one over the other. This one tends to arrive a little bit faster. Right. Keto Crate gives you a, a nice website that has all of the different prices and everything. So it's kind of like whichever one you want. They've both been stepping up their game a little bit lately. Yeah, you can definitely feel the competition yeah. because they're just packing them more and more every single month. And, you know, you get different flavors of products too. So yeah. sometimes they'll have the same like bars or meat sticks or something, but you'll get a completely different flavor. And I like that. Yeah. Now we do actually purchase our keto box, but we like to see different treats that are in there. Yeah. If you are interested in the keto box, I'll leave a link down in the description. It is $40 a month. Uh, you can cancel it anytime. They also have three month and uh, six month subscriptions which save you a little bit of money and like if you that. use the code two crazy ketos that'll get you 15 percent off of your first month you ready yeah one thing i did want to mention is the keto box doesn't have a nice website that has all of the different prices yeah. so to make the video go just a little bit faster i've already gone through everything and pulled all the prices so that we don't have to spend a lot of time looking on the internet you looked in here without me i did that's okay is don't worry i didn't try anything is it good I think so. So so what we like to do when we do these boxes is we go through everything. We're going to go over the ingredients, the nutrition label, and then also how much it costs. Okay. So uh, first thing that's in here is there's some cards. Business cards. There's a coupon for Parm Crisps for a dollar off. I like this. This is a little card for a referral friend. If you take a picture of yourself with the box, you can enter into uh, win some giveaways. <gasps> Dang! Dang card. And then there's also a card for Slim Fast Keto. Slim Fast. So we were actually, I was actually messaging with somebody about Slim Fast the other day. They were mentioning stuff that they have at Sam's Club for the nutrition shakes, comparing it to like Keto Chow. Um, honestly, their fat bombs actually have pretty decent ingredients. We were actually surprised by that. Yeah, but a lot of the other products, not so much. It's got things like different types of gums in it. It's got uh, cellulose in it. They also have a lot of maltodextrin in there. So personally, I'm not a fan of the other stuff. We'll kind of see what's in here. I've never seen the product that's in here before. Yeah. But their nutrition shakes, I'm not a big fan not of Not a huge fan. And man cannot live by fat bombs yeah. alone. And even though the nutrition shakes are only like $1.25 to $2 per drink, you're only getting like 180 calories. And again, not the greatest ingredients in the if world. If I give you garbage and I put it in a box and I only charge you 50 cents for it, still garbage. Yep. You want to go first? Yes, actually. Skinny pasta. Skinny pasta. We'll go ahead and cover our face. There we go. Yay. I try to cover my face, but keep one eye on the camera to make sure it actually gets focused. So I never understand it because my hand is the same color as my face. We just have a camera that is really, really good at tracking your face. So my if it eyeball. even sees a little piece of it, it's going to focus on your face. So weird, but okay. You ready? Um, all right. So this is fettuccine shape pasta. Okay. Keto and paleo friendly, nine calories per serving. And there's a whole, it says it's pre-cooked and ready in two mi uh, minutes. It's that cognac. Cognac noodles. Noodles, gluten-free, sugar-free, fat-free, cholesterol-free, contains fiber, all natural, low carb, grain-free, no soy, no dairy, and no odor. And if you've ever had cognac noodles before. Some of them are good, some of them are It's a cook up so like good. that. Yeah. All right, so. 
It says, what is cognac? Cognac is a plant native to Japan and has been used there for hundreds of years. We harvest the cognac roots to create noodles in different shapes. Cognac contains fiber and absorbs water to help you feel full. And I do like to use them sometimes to kind of like bulk up my meals. Um, nutrition facts, two servings in this container. Um, calories per serving, 10. So there's total fat, zero, protein, zero, total carbohydrates, five, but dietary fiber is five. Looking for ingredients, water, cognac, tapioca, calcium hydroxide, and citric acid for freshness. Okay. And uh, on Amazon, they are $23.99 for six bags. Now, one thing when we go through the prices, we look on Amazon first, we can't find it there, we go directly to the company's website. Just be aware that sometimes you're gonna find these products more expensive in one place than the other, so I always tell people, price shop everything. Yeah. Okay, you ready? Yes. Okay. This one looks interesting. What is that bearded this is gentleman? This Guy Gone Keto. Is and this Guy Gone Keto? This is a teriyaki sauce, and this one really, really has me intrigued. What? I've heard the name Guy Gone Keto, but I've never tried any of their products. This is made with MCT oil and allulose. This is rich with ginger. Two net carbs per serving. So on the back, there is a little bit of copy. I'm going to go ahead and read it. It says, the Guy Gone Keto family of products was created uh, for you, the ketogenic and low-carb lifestyle enthusiast made with uh, keto, keto sweet, which is a new natural low-calorie sweetener containing allulose, stevia, and monk fruit. Basically, it's his blend of right. allulose, stevia, and monk fruit. Proprietary blend. Yep. The FDA requires to be listed as an added sugar, but the fact that it is allulose, like stevia and monk fruit, has shown to have no effect on blood glucose levels. Studies have shown that allulose may even reduce blood glucose levels and enhance fat metabolism, which might, along with exercise, help you achieve and maintain a healthy body weight. Okay, so, it says the ingredients in here are gluten-free tamari soy sauce, wow. which is water, soybeans, salt, and sugar. Then you have keto sweet, which is allulose, monk fruit, and stevia. You have spices, less than 2% of MCT oil, which is medium train triglycerides. Then you have toasted sesame oil, guar gum, and citric acid. So it's got really good ingredients. Now you did hear sugar, but that's part of the soy sauce. Right. Wish it wasn't made with soy sauce, maybe coconut aminos, but you know, a little bit of soy sauce isn't gonna kill you. It's just when you start overdoing it on all that soy. I am intrigued by this. Okay, ready? So you have 20, uh, 30 servings in this pouch. It is a pretty big fat. This is 14 ounces. I feel like you'd have to transfer it into something else to hold it. Well, no, it's got a nice little thing on the top. Oh my gosh, I didn't Look, even notice that. It's got a nice little thing. How cute. Okay, so there are uh, 30 servings in here. One tablespoon is a serving, 10 calories. Two total carbohydrates, one gram of sugar, which is probably coming from the soy, one gram of protein. And then it's saying one gram, oh, one gram of sugar, which is actually going to be your allulose. Mm -hmm. So it's really one net carb per serving. Oh, they're saying two net carbs, but I you gotta can take tell out that you, allulose. I'll go with the two total carbs, two net carbs. I am so excited right now. I want to like grill up some chicken, put it over cauliflower rice, and put a nice serving of that over I'm it. I'm thinking if you've ever made my crack slaw recipe, oh, which yeah. is kind of like, a, it's like an egg roll in the bowl, it's, mm -hmm. but it's a southern thing, is crack slaw. Right. Um, but instead of adding all those things, just putting a little bit of this in there, or same kind of thing, just a little bit of ground beef with this and cabbage, that kind of stuff, and putting a couple of tablespoons of this in there. I am so excited to find this. Like, without these boxes, I would not know these yep. things exist. Okay, so on Amazon, this is $16.49. They also have a steak sauce, a barbecue sauce, and a ketchup, but I did not look at the ingredients on that. But it is all listed on Amazon. So there's another reason why I probably wouldn't try it just from the, the initial price point. Right. So I'm glad to have it in the keto box and then we'll see, is it super amazing and we have to have it in our life and we will budget for it or is this just a nice treat? Yep, okay, next up. Ooh, pure organic, sugar-free, bakeable chocolate chip cookie mix. Did we have that in Keto Crate too? No. We had a different one. So that is exactly what we were talking about at the beginning. These are different boxes. They both have a similar product or the same product line in it, but right. this is different. We got the brownies in the other one. Oh, okay. So now we can try the sugar cookie, sugar cookies. So let's see. It says um, 16 servings per container, 
three tablespoons of mix makes two cookies so i'm going to read the prepared because they have the mix if you just you know use the nutritional values for the mix but as prepared 130 calories per serving eight grams of fat one gram of protein 16 total carbs seven dietary fiber and then four erythritol so 16 minus 11 would be what five mm -hmm. five net carbs per box they're saying that all you need is an egg and a stick of unsalted butter the ingredients are organic chickpea flour organic soluble tapioca fiber organic chocolate chips um organic erythritol organic almond flour baking powder which is cornstarch sodium bicarbonate mono calcium phosphate sea salt organic natural flavor organic stevia leaf extract contains almonds sounds good i want to look at something did it tell you it doesn't tell you though oh it does tell you what's in the chocolate chips that's what i wanted to know so the chocolate chips are organic soluble tapioca fiber organic cacao nibs organic cacao cocoa butter Organic sunflower, less than natural flavors, organic stevia leaf extract. I just wanted to see if they were using regular chocolate chips. Yeah. So the price on this was $10 a bag on Amazon. We will definitely try this. I will say this though, looking at the ingredients, like they're okay. They're not horrible bad. I, I could do without all the soluble tapioca fiber. My thing is it's like another big company trying to take advantage of this stuff. If you really do want a pre-baked cookie mix yeah. or rather a pre-mixed thing like a package, mm -hmm. check out Goodies. Like yeah. Goodies, I'll leave a link down below. She's got some phenomenal products. I mean, she's got cornbreads, cookies, cakes, you name it. It's a person from within the keto community. Right. So we'll try this one, but I would also check out the goodies. And again, I'll leave a link down below. This is more for a night when we want to make a batch of cookies and everyone in the house, whether they're keto or not, can enjoy them. Right. And you'll be able to get these in a store, but I still prefer supporting somebody small. Me too. Okay. My turn. Yes. Let's see. What are we going to go with? I'm looking for some. Oh, we'll go with something like, eh, I don't know. So this is the Slim Fast product. This is a Slim Fast Fat, fat Bomb, bomb shot. shot. Okay. What is that? So this says right on the front, one net carb. I feel like this is just gonna be MCT oil. I have not looked at it. I literally, when I went through the box for the prices, just picked up the product, looked up the name, looked up the price. So it's I didn't like look at everything that's in it. Nut butter or anything? I don't know. So it says grab and go. Slim fast keto fat bomb shots are ultra convenient to grab and enjoy on the go. So matter how, no matter how busy you are or how hectic your life gets, it's always easy to stay on plan and achieve your weight loss goals. So it How says busy are we? the ingredients are purified water. <laughs> then we have MCT oil, which is C8 um, triglycerides from coconut. Okay, so I was just, at least they're using C8. Then you have erythritol, acacia gum, natural flavor, xanthan gum, cellulose, sea salt, uh, oleogosaccharides, potassium sorbate, citric acid, and stevia leaf extract. There is one serving in a container, I'd hope, 100 calories per serving, one, uh, 10 grams of fat, zero grams of protein, three total carbohydrates. There's two grams of erythritol, so it's one net carb. And this is a tangy orange cream flavor. I don't know. For this kind of package, I, I kind of just want like a nut butter. Yeah, I mean, basically all this is is MCT oil with some flavoring and some sugar in there. Yeah. I'd rather just go to Trader Joe's and grab a thing of coconut oil, squirt that in my mouth for a lot less money. We didn't even look at the price yet. Or yeah, eat a packet of nut butter and at least know it's going to taste good because it's three carbs. I feel like that's just Mio mixed with coconut oil. Yeah. That's my, in my mind, that's what I'm thinking is just like wet and, Mio. And here's the best part or the worst part, I guess. It's $17.31 for 10 of them. So it's $1.70 a pack for basically no. MCT oil with a little bit of erythritol and a sweetener and a flavor in there. Buy a great big Kirkland's no, thank you. coconut oil, take a spoonful out of it and put a couple drops of I would much rather for, flavoring. for three carbs, actually for one carb or two, depending on the flavor, I'd rather put a scoop of Perfect Keto MCT powder in my... Uh, coffee or just take some MC oil and squirt it down my mouth or like I said get some macadamia nut butter from F-bomb or something like yeah. that. It's going to be the same calories. But feel like food. Probably cheaper depending on what you're Actual using. Actual food. And yeah. No thank you. Have some food. Your turn. All right. 
Parm Crisps. Parm Crisps. Not much to say about them. We see them everywhere, right? I love Parm Crisps, but I like being reminded that you can purchase them in these little packets. Yeah. This is the perfect thing to drop in a kid's school lunch. They're crunchy, they're cheesy, they're delicious. I don't care how picky your child is, they're gonna love these. Yeah, some of the Costco's sell, whether it be Palm Crisp or the other brands where they have them in the little individual bags. Um, and they are $3.49 on Amazon for a 1.7 ounce bag. You didn't read the ingredients. Oh, I'm sorry. You want me to read it? Yeah, I'm used to saying that. Ingredients ahead. are aged Parmesan cheese, which is part skim milk, cheese cultures, salt, and natural animal rennet. Not much to the ingredients list, just cheese. I'm interested in starting to use some rennet. I actually would like some animal stuff and... Here we go. Know. Here we go. 100 calories per this little bag, seven grams of fat, nine grams of protein, zero carbohydrates. I love them. My turn. Nui. 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 It used to be called the Keto Cookie when they first came out. I feel like that Had was catchier. Well, they had to change their name for it. They didn't want to appeal to just keto. Oh, okay. They're so actually that. really good cookies. Recently reformulated. I actually like the new formulation. I do too. Let's hold it up there. We, this is the chocolate chip. We had, was it the keto last month? We had the snickerdoodle. Oh, it was good. That one was really good. Really good. Okay, so the ingredients on this are blanched almonds, tapioca fiber, chocolate chips, which are natural unsweetened chocolate, allulose, and cocoa butter. Then you have egg yolks, coconut oil, allulose, unsweetened cream butter, heavy cream, coconut flour, water, egg whites, less than 2% of... Natural flavors, pure bourbon vanilla extract, vegetable fibers, MCT oil, sunflower lecithin, cellulose gum, baking soda, cognac, xanthan gum, uh, sea salt, and stevia leaf extract. Serving size is one cookie, and this is a big cookie. It is a nice As size you can see, cookie. It is a big cookie, even though it's upside down because of the back, but it's a decent sized cookie. Respectable. Um, 200 calories per cookie, 150 calories from, from fat, 17 grams of fat, Four grams of protein, 16 total carbohydrates, eight grams of dietary fiber. Then it says, uh, so that is what, 16 minus eight is eight. eight. Five grams of allulose, making three. it three net carbs. It also has something called other carbohydrates, which are seven. But don't I don't know what that is. Other. I don't know what that is. So they're not deducting it, so we won't deduct it. So on the back, it does say, feed your greatness. We get it. It's a struggle to give up sugar. That's why we created Nui, a delicious low sugar cookie to calm your sweet cravings and fuel your day. Now you can have your goals and eat them too. One thing I like about the new formulation is they're a little bit chewier, so it lasts longer. Right. Some, some keto cookies are very uh, crumbly. <laughs> or it's almost like cloud bread. Yeah. It's just so done. Gone. Most keto cookies, I find they're all the same. Watch Out of Keto talks about the same thing. It's like erythritol and almond flour. They yeah. all pretty much taste the same. Their new formulation is very, very different. Very nice. Um, the price on these, an eight pack, $24.95. Next up, Dang! Dang Bar. The Dang Bar. And this is good news because this was in the Keto Crate. This one was in the Keto Crate this month as and well. And this one being in here means that you will also get one. Yeah. This is a new flavor, right? It's peanut the new butter. Flavor, peanut butter. I was already planning on not sharing this, so now we will be able to share. I love that. All right, so let's see. What's in this guy? Peanuts, chicory root fiber, almonds, cocoa butter, pea protein crisps, which are pea protein rice flour, calcium carbonate. There's pea protein, sunflower seeds, coconut, natural flavors, Chia seeds, sea salt, sunflower lecithin, stevia extract, and mixed tofurols. It does contain peanuts and tree nuts, almonds and coconuts. I would hope so, considering it's peanut butter flavor. The if it doesn't contain peanuts, we'd have an issue. Yeah, that would be a problem. But um, <laughs> the one thing about Dang Bars, Dang, is you can see everything you're eating. Yeah. It's all natural. And we said it in the Keto Crate video, but Dang Bars are not like a normal like candy bar kind of replacement. Like a lot of people use like the perfect keto bars or something like that. This is more like a granola bar. Right. So the nutrition facts are one bar is 210 calories, 15 grams of fat, 9 grams of protein, 11 total carbs, 6 fiber, which is 5 net carbs. Okay. And uh, they sell for 250 bar. Obviously, you have to buy them in a box of 12 uh, next up, there's actually three. They actually give you three different things. This is Ooh, really cool. But the same This thing. is a new product. We have not yet tried this. 
What is that? Um, this is Kiss My Keto. Kiss My Keto. Kiss My Keto or Kiss My Grits, right? And for those of you who, like us, grew up in the 70s and 80s. Well, it wouldn't be grits. So this is Keto Bone Broth. This nice. is a new product from Kiss My Keto. They, Kiss My Keto has been stepping up their game. Heck yes. I'm going to leave a link down below if you're interested in this. And we have a coupon code. I don't remember if it's 10 or 15% off, but it's obviously it's two crazy ketos. So there are three different bone broths here. There is a Thai green curry chicken. Oh, wow. Beef chili and lemon turkey thyme. We are going to have to review these. Okay, so... We're gonna pick up the, there's, okay, so the Thai green curry chicken has one net carb. The lemon turkey thyme has two net carbs and the beef jelly has three. Well, so, I like you have options. So we're gonna start off with this one. The ingredients in this are chicken bone broth, medium chain triglycerides, natural flavor, salt, inulin, dehydrated garlic, dehydrated onion, guar gum, xanthan gum, sodium castanate, and uh, sunflower lecithin, turmeric, and no more than 2% of silicon dioxide to prevent caking. So it's 80 calories, four grams of fat, nine grams of protein, two total carbohydrates, one gram of dietary fiber. I like it. So then soup. we have this soup one is, is back. the chili one. There is soup for you. Yes. We have beef bone broth, dehydrated vegetables, which is tomato, garlic, and onion, natural flavors, salt, medium trained triglycerides, guar gum, xanthan gum, spices, inulin, chili powder, sodium castanate, sunflower lecithin, and no more than 2% of silicon dioxide to prevent caking. Man, depending on how flavorful they are, that would be a really easy thing for a quick Camping. Camp. I'm thinking about camping. Camping, and also when it's like a crazy schedule and you can just put this and some water and hamburger in a pot and like boom we've got dinner oh yeah i didn't even think about that i just like drinking bone broth so i'm always thinking about like what are we going to do when i have nothing thought out 70 calories 1.5 grams of fat 10 grams of protein four total carbohydrates one gram of dietary fiber obviously it has the higher carbs because it's tomato garlic onions things yeah. like that and then the last one is the turkey one i know this one's going a little bit longer but these are all different Turkey bone broth, medium trained triglycerides, natural flavors, salt, inulin, dehydrated garlic, dehydrated onion, guar gum, xanthan gum, spices, sodium castanate, sunflower lecithin, no more than 2% silicon dioxide to prevent caking, 80 calories, 4 grams of fat, 10 grams of protein, 3 total carbohydrates, 1 gram of dietary fiber. Which one are you most interested in? Um, honestly, I wouldn't mind the chili one, but this Thai green cherry chicken is really the yeah, one that's intriguing me that's the most. That's me too. Uh, price on these on their website, 15 pack for $27.99. That's so, not bad. Just a little bit less than $2 a piece. That's about normal price for But then it would be like bone broth. dinner. Yeah. All right, next Great way to break up, up fast. Ooh, is free range chicken. Ooh. DNX bars. Nice, a meat stick. These are so unique looking. I love the DNX bars. They have good ingredients. They they also have meat sticks, which are whole 360s. I mean, just awesome products. You're gonna freak out over this because okay. it's peri peri style. Ooh, I love anything hot. I know. Anything hot. Peri peri style seasoning. Um. Okay, so the ingredients on this is free range chicken, sea salt, organic spices, celery juice powder, which is celery powder and sea salt, organic ground ginger, organic ground um, cardamom seed, organic garlic powder, organic minced onion, dried spinach, organic oregano, encapsulated lactic acid, and organic cayenne pepper. Is that some great ingredients? See what I'm saying? Some like super clean ingredients. It's actually, if you go to our website on um, our favorite products, this is one of them. There's yeah. a link right on the website for their product. It actually says refrigerate after opening. There's no soy, there's no MSG. The chicken used is fed 100% vegetarian diet with no antibiotics ever what's the nutrition on so 60 calories per bar one and a half grams of fat 13 grams of protein remember it's a meat stick right right so um total carbs is one from all of the flavorings and zero fiber so one net carb but all good stuff dollar 66 a bar when you buy a box of i think it's 10 if i remember right Oh, only one thing. This is just like a little coupon thing, I guess. Oh, it's a... Uh, no, it's not. Pure Stevia. It's just a little... Oh, like a stevia. packet to use. We have to look at that, though, because some of those products have, like, dextrose in it. Wonky. Okay, so this is Laguna Salt Company. Laguna. Pink Himalayan salt. That makes me think about vacation. We will talk about this, but personally... um, I like Redmond Real Salt. We're Redmond folk. So there's a link down below. 
um, yeah, this this kind of like has me concerned right off the top of the bat because this is nothing really to say about it. It's Laguna Salt Company Pink Himalayan Handcrafted Sea Salt. Ingredients are sink, uh, sea salt. It's calling itself Pink Himalayan. But on the back, this is from the Laguna Salt Company, Laguna Beach, California. So that's not the Himalayan. Handcrafted in California. Hmm. So how do we have a pink Himalayan salt, which is supposed to be coming from the Himalayan mountains, being handcrafted in California? We don't. <laughs> and this little tiny container, which is three ounces, is actually 10 bucks on Amazon. No. So get yourself some Redmond. There's a link down below. And Redmond actually comes from the United States. You don't have to worry about it traveling across the globe. We actually recently bought the rocks. Yeah. Like the whole rocks. Oh my gosh, love those things. I am loving those things. I, I keep one, one in I keep one in my purse in a Ziploc bag. So that is, oh, we were going to open this up, right? See if it gives you any 411. Don't use your teeth. Okay, so this is pure organic stevia. Okay. With a $1.50 off coupon. It says you can find it at Walmart, Whole Foods Market, HEB, Wegmans, Amazon.com, and other fine retailers. I have seen it at Walmart. Okay. It says Pure is not your average sugar alternative. It's organic, non-GMO, has zero calories, and is the best tasting stevia on the market. The ingredients in this are organic erythritol, organic stevia leaf extract, uh, and then natural flavors. Just understand that this is going to probably say zero carbs, right. but it really isn't because one teaspoon of erythritol has four carbs in it i mean four total carbs right so this isn't bad but you again, only need 20 a day you're better off if you can just use liquid stevia liquid stevia is going to be much better for you but if you want the powder if you want something to keep in your purse something like that this was your option yeah anything interesting i am totally excited about this you're excited about that I'm excited about this. Unfortunately, this is the month of January. We are on a fast. We can't eat anything, though. These aren't really eating. I actually want to try this. You want to try that? that that'll like come with our trip to Omaha. Spicy. But uh, yeah, I am really excited about these. Oops, uh, these bone broths. Me too. And that one as well. Mm -hmm. So that is this month's keto box. Again, there is a link down below if you're interested in getting it. It's forty dollars. You can use the coupon code 2 crazy ketos That'll get you 15% off your first box. Let us know down in the comment section which of these items is intriguing you the most. Yeah, absolutely. Like, And what would you use some of these things for? Would you be putting this the teriyaki on beef? Would you be putting it on chicken? Like, What are you excited about? Yeah. So please do us a favor and hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.